Hello again, everyone. Terry Earthwind Nichols from EvolutionaryHealer.com with my dear friend and client, F. Francois Everett. Welcome, my dear. How are you? I'm doing well. Thank you. Just as excited Good. to be talking to you today. Yes, I'm excited too because, yeah, you know, there's uh, a lot of people from a lot of different uh, backgrounds have been with us over the last going on three years. and this month, uh, which is beautiful. And uh, for that matter, we're on five continents in nine countries now. It's amazing. And and uh, just two more days will be a whole three years old. So it'll be, it's an interesting anniversary. For you, it's been an interesting life and an interesting journey. And, and we're very, very glad that you decided to, to uh, be filmed about your story and, and, and your life uh, as it, was before CR and how we met and you know what's happened since so why don't you tell us a little bit about that old self all right well ever since I met you and Linda I was intrigued by what CR was and what it could do so um, and then obviously we were you know in a mastermind together and so we became friends and Love that journey, and um, when the opportunity to do the CR came up, I was really, really drawn to it. So, um, you know, like I said a minute ago, like sometimes I sort of can't even remember what it was before and what it's like after. But looking back, I can, I can remember some points that were such, I guess, such a release, you know, to just things that I perceived a certain way that then I was able to perceive differently. And really let go of and so that's probably one of the biggest things that I got it was like a sense of release and a sense of freedom in who I get to be in the world well that's all wonderful and and um, uh, well for you you know we're, we're not gonna go into your CR obviously uh, and and you know just the simplest things that uh, can happen to us as as children uh, can be just twisted just slightly and victimized and um, it just changes our world. It changes the way we think about the world and how we act and react in it, as I say a lot. And and um, it's amazing how our senses, uh, just the way certain people will say a phrase or a sentence will trigger us in some way and bring back the, that that uncomfortable feeling, possibly fear sometimes, and we don't even know what it is or why, you know? Uh, there's a lot of us uh, that, uh, that I have as clients right now who have spent years in therapy, who no longer go. I guess their therapist is not excited about me, but that's okay. And, and for you, uh, some significant things as far as your self-worth and, and uh, where you've taken your beautiful business uh, since the CR over the last, oh, about a year and a half, I guess now. And mm -hmm. and could you talk to us a little bit about that that change? Yeah. You know, one of the things that I just remembered now was um, that was really powerful is how you do engage the senses. Like, I actually kind of forgotten about that. But as soon as you said it, it was, it could just came it was just alive. Like I remember like how much that was part of it. And like, it really, I think as a whole, cause I, yeah, you know, like my CR is personal, so I don't want to necessarily be all these different things, but what is really true about it is that it reframed so much. So in the reframe, everything looks different and everything going forward can look different. Like you can literally, I think the biggest thing is understanding that, what was in the past and I didn't have a bad past or anything but the way I interpreted certain things was fine and I could still move forward like I think what happened for me the most is like I got clear about a new point of creation like right now like right after the CR right now right here everything is a new point where I get to create what I want going forward so I think at that time I was sort of in an evolution where I was like thinking about rebranding and like, you know, doing a slightly different message. Like I used to just focus on the, you know, entrepreneurial moms and then I wanted to work with women in general. And 
Um, and funny enough, now I'm working a lot with women on getting their speaking confidence, if you can believe that. So, but that was definitely something that I needed to get to. And um, the, the CR, I think just in expressing what can come out was huge because probably everything that I held back and didn't express like came out. And so that was a point from which going forward, I was able to just express a lot more easily. And as a matter of fact, I just completed a client intensive like 30 minutes ago. And what we worked on with her and her new business associate was in asking all the right questions with their clients and like really being able to communicate what's really true for you in the moment in a way that's embracing everyone. It's like for the highest good of all. So actually, now that I think about it, it's all coming out, right? Like the CR was such a release of like me feeling like I wasn't really able to speak out without permission or speak out without, you know, feeling like, oh my gosh, I might not be appropriate or just to get my communication going. Yeah, I, I you know, in, if the, if something like that happens to you at an early enough age, it, particularly for for uh, a lot of people pre-language, if something happens, they don't know how to speak from their heart. They don't know how to speak out because it was muffled before they even had a chance to begin that process, which is quite amazing uh, that we're able to to go back and help people with that. And yeah, and and. Uh, Francois, for everyone that's that's uh, watching this, I, I would like you to put your your website on there and say a little bit about what you actually do because you said you had a client intensive, and I'm sure they were interested in in knowing something about that. Sure. Um, so the website is francoiseeverett.com, and um, <clears throat> excuse me. And so sort of my rebrand now is um, Elegance Business and Lifestyle, and it's really taking elegance in a certain number of ways, which is, yes, there's that feeling of, like, feeling good about yourself and feeling elegant and feeling like you can be elegant no matter what your circumstances are. And then there's also the elegance that works really powerfully in business, as in, like, elegant business solutions and being in their total simplicity. So taking away what doesn't work, like, really keeping it simple. And... That's also encompassing women being able to truly express like their confident, like their clarity and their confidence. And I'm amazed at how much that is coming up lately. And it's something that really lights me up. Like it's literally, I keep refining, you know, my, I think we all do, right? We keep refining our work. And right now it's like really focusing on that deeper self-expression and being able to speak their truth and, and really getting centered and confident so that when they're out going out in the world, like or networking events or speaking even like this um, or teaching, whatever it is that they're doing, that they have the confidence to really speak. Like I, that's where like most of my most recent clients have come from is in wanting that self-expression piece. And then there's also, you know, the, tangible business pieces that actually help them move forward. That's great. So Francoise Everett.com. Check her out mm -hmm. on there. She's got a really great niche to to the marketplace and she's a wonderful person as you can hear in her voice and see by her mannerisms, especially for my practitioners who are watching you right now. They're profiling you like I do and they know what a wonderful person you are as well. And so this has been fabulous. Thank you so much for, for giving us some time today and speaking about your journey and where it's going. And, and as always, it's always marvelous to have an opportunity to just catch up with you and your lovely daughter. Oh, Terry, thank you so much. This is really just a joyful, wonderful interaction with you. And thank you so much. It was really, it was really fun. And, um, yeah, many much love and blessings to you and Linda, too. Oh, thank you. Thank you very much. EvolutionaryHealer.com, Terry Earthwind Nichols.